Look at any time signature. It's a number over a number. Really simple, ready? Check it out. How many of what? The first question that we are answering is how many beats, beats are in a given measure? For four, it's gonna be four beats in the measure. But how are we supposed to know what we're counting? We're counting spoons? So that's what the handy dandy bottom number's for. This is gonna tell us exactly what we're counting and the different numbers refer to different divisions of notes. We have whole notes, half notes, quarter notes, 16th notes, 32nd notes, 64th notes, 128th notes, oh God. You could look at it as one is a whole note, two is a half note, four, the most common one, that refers to a quarter note. So it's telling us Four quarter notes in a measure. Sometimes you might see three fours. Well, that's three quarter notes in a measure. Five four, that's five quarter notes in a measure. See where I'm going with this? Eight is eighth note, 16 is 16th note. If you wanna be crazy, you can count like 15 16 Don't put that in your score because everybody will hate you. If we just apply that how many of what thing, we can literally figure out any time signature ever. What if you saw something crazy like 11 64? Okay, well that's 11, that's how many? 11 in a measure and 64, 64th notes. Why would somebody write that? I don't know. How many of what? Remember, it'll save your life. Go play weird time signatures and stuff and you'll be good.